See if, <laughs> see if I can even do this. Do you want this. me to go up front too? No. no. Okay. That's fine. That's all right. I was worried about something on my toes. <laughs> Johnny can't eat a broke his foot that way. I was like, nope, nope, pull my feet in. Yeah. That felt weird. So I wanted to just go over and explain the difference and what I was seeing. So I've got my conventional stance here. So I'm a little bit wider than most people go. That's just how it works for me. Uh, but when I go to get the bar, I bend over and then I crouch down. Now I go lower than most people are gonna go and that's due to short arms and trying to make sure my lower back straight. So don't necessarily go as low as I do. Most people will say that I'm squatting the weight up. So don't do that unless uh, you need to. But when I switch to a sumo stance, the first thing is my feet go wider, obviously, because that's what we're doing in a sumo, and your hands are going to go in. So you want your hands to hang straight down. Now, if you're in the knurling or on a smooth, you're going to want to go out, so at least you have a little bit on the knurling. But if I was to bend over and grab it like a conventional, I would just grab here and then start the pull. So what we're looking at is this distance between the hips here, when I go back to my conventional stance, will be roughly the same. Because I'm setting up for a sumo the same way I would for a conventional. And that's what I was saying you don't want to do. When you are doing a sumo, you're pulling your pelvis to the bar. So it's, a, it's very uncomfortable for me. Glenn can't even do it. He, uh, we tried. We tried a couple times. But instead of bending over grabbing the bar, I am pulling my pelvis to the bar, keeping my back as tight as possible, grabbing it, and then I'm gonna pull. So what you're looking at, your hips should be significantly closer to the bar as opposed to here, where I'm gonna do a conventional. I'm in here getting tight. Oh, that's so uncomfortable. All right, so come over here a second. I'm not even gonna pull it. Uh, you, you conventional sumo, I'm gonna pull sumo just one time. And I'm not a sumo puller. At all, not a sumo puller. So my forearm's gonna suck, but I'm gonna try to do this again. So again, we're pulling ourselves to the bar, getting tight. And it's all in the hips. Don't slam your foot. Like Candido. So again, this would be, if I was gonna try and conventional, I'm gonna try and pull it. sumo pull versus my attempt at a sumo pull. So that should look quite a bit different and ooh, it's all right here and uh, I feel nothing in my lower back at all. And that's it. Okay.